Now we have Isaac Lincoln Lux Creed Rio Verse and Valley. Kayla Lowry is sharing the meaning of her twins' names with fans. A week after officially revealing the names of her babies, the mom of seven takes to TikTok February 14th to explain how she came up with Verse and Valley for her newborn son and daughter, sharing that her 10-year-old Lincoln played a role in naming his younger brother. Verse came from Iverson, which is a name that Lincoln recommended obviously would be on his list because he's a huge basketball fan. The Teen Mom star then details the sentimental meaning behind her only daughter's name. And for Valley, I moved when I was a kid to the Lehigh Valley. And I know everyone who lives in the Lehigh Valley is gonna be like, oh no, that's not where she's going. It is. So the Lehigh Valley really shaped a big part of who I am. Um, it's a huge part of why I am where I am today. And so I really liked Valley and I felt like it was not super different. It still was a name that you could grow with. It wasn't too weird. And as far as nicknames go for Valley, Kaylin says she hasn't found any she likes yet. Also no nicknames that I like for Valley. I really don't like the nickname Val. If she wants to go by Val when she's older, that'll be her choice. But I like that it's just Valley and there's no nickname for it. The MTV alum also addresses fans who have been wondering whether she intentionally chose alliterative names for the newest additions to her family. These were not intentional in any way. It just happened. And I thought it was funny because I'm like now Isaac's sisters, both of them are beginning with me. Last month, the podcast host, who's also mom to sons Isaac 14 with ex Joe Rivera, Lincoln 10 with ex Javi Maraquin, Lux 6 and Creed 3 with ex Chris Lopez and baby Rio with Elijah share that her newborn twins spent weeks in the neonatal intensive care unit after being born prematurely. The former reality star shared on her Barely Famous podcast that Verse ended up being discharged from the hospital before his sister. And earlier this week, Kaylin posted some never before seen footage of Valley's solo stay in the NICU explaining in the previously recorded clip that Valley being alone in a hospital far away was extremely challenging for their family. Day 14 for baby girl to in the NICU and it's been really hard because it's an hour away and I'm gonna go up and see her. I called this morning just now able to get up there um, just because I have kids at home, her twins at home and just like having them separated is really hard. Nobody in the NICU can be there under 18 years old, so none of the kids have gotten to meet her. And once the once baby boy was discharged from the NICU, he was not allowed back in. He hasn't been allowed back in. So Elijah and I have been taking turns. Um, I did get to stay overnight with her one night, and I'm hoping to do that again this weekend, um, just because it's easier than driving back and forth, and I hate that she's left alone.